happens. Tonight we begin in Boone County where the Zionsville Police Department has formed a brand new unit to better serve people with behavioral health issues. WRTV Stephanie Wade shows us why this was created and the impact they hope it makes on the community. Honestly, a lot of law enforcement calls do have some sort of mental health crisis in conjunction with it, honestly. You go into a blind situation, you don't know if this person um, you know, it's just angry or if there is some underlying issues. Police often respond to calls involving people suffering a mental health crisis and who do not pose a threat to the public. Unfortunately, they, they do have a lot of social work on their plate, even though that's not really probably what they signed up for. To better serve people in need of a clinician when police are dispatched, the Zionsville Police Department created its REACH unit, which stands for Resources Evaluating assisting in community health. Chief Michael Spears has been pushing for a behavioral health unit since he joined the department earlier this year. He came from the Indianapolis Metro Police Department, which has had a similar unit since 2016. I do think this is a newer thing that police departments are starting to go to because I think they all recognize the need for it. Detective Elizabeth Frost will lead the unit when there's a mental health situation, she says both an officer and a local clinician from Integrative Wellness will respond and assess how they can assist and connect them with the appropriate resources. We could simply be getting um, helping them make that phone call because sometimes that's really hard. A clinician will have the time to spend with people in crisis. Lynette Clark says listen to them and to get their needs met quicker. Once we get um, things um, de-escalated at some level, um, then we will be able to really assess the needs probably a little deeper than um, you know our law enforcement community. It's not just for the safety of our first responders, but it's also for the community that these um, people live in that are in crisis. You know, they live in neighborhoods just like we do. They have families. Um, sometimes these families. Uh, feel like they're at a dead end and they don't know what else to do. That's where we would step in and help them. Stephanie Wade, WRTV. Well, in November, the REACH unit was called five times to respond to a crisis. I want to give you a list of mental health providers in both Boone County and the state to help those in crisis. There are a lot of resources out there for you, and confidentiality is part of their practice. We will also put this list on our website at WRTV.com and on our WRTV mobile app.